The results of using bolts incorrectly can lead to serious problems. It is critical that you choose the correct nuts and bolts for the application and follow the manufacturer's guidelines and best practices. Hi everybody, I'm Brianna Heinemann, and for the next few minutes, I'm gonna cover with you steps that you can take to prevent bolt failure. Bolts are a crucial fastener for a wide range of applications, including commercial and industrial products. The functionality of a bolt is straightforward, but the mechanical properties and design of a bolt can be more complex. Tightening a bolt generates several types of mechanical forces that help the joint remain secure. These forces include clamping force, preloading force, shear force, and tension force. To learn more about these specific forces, please check out our blog. The link is in the description below. Bolt specifications are important to understand and keep in mind. This includes the type of bolt it is, its dimensions, thread density, material grade, and tightening requirements. The type of nut that is used in conjunction with the bolt is also an important factor in the performance of the bolt. Now, let's talk about the six most common types of bolt failure. Number one, bolt fatigue failure. Loosening of a bolt leads to fatigue failure. This is because the bolted joint can no longer absorb the external loads. The clamping force is then lost, which prevents absorption into the parts and leads to increased load on the bolt. If a bolt experiences high level of stress for a prolonged period of time, it is likely it will fail due to fatigue. Number two, shear thread stripping. This is also a common type of bolt failure. This occurs when the shear stress exceeds the bolt strength and causes the joint members to slip sideways. To avoid shear failure, it is recommended to do a thorough check of the bolt connection. Avoid excessive overturning and tightening of the bolt. Number three, bolt thread stripping. When tightening a bolt and the pairing of two threads occurs, shear stress gets added to the threaded part of the bolt. Thread stripping is a risk due to an excessive amount of stress. To avoid thread stripping, utilize a bolt with the correct thread design for the application. Number four, bolt quality. The quality of the bolt you're using is incredibly important in preventing failure. If you are using a bolt in a vital project, make sure the nuts and bolts are being replaced as soon as they are showing any sign of fatigue or loosening. If you are using a bolt in a vital project, make sure you source the bolt from a reliable retailer like fastenersplus.com. Number five is bolt corrosion. Bolts are commonly used in corrosive environments. Bolts exposed to incompatible substances, including oxygen, metal products, and naturally blending chemicals are at risk of rusting. If a bolt is used in automobile components, they're in danger of being exposed to fluid and engine leaks. This can cause the fastener to deteriorate over time. Corrosion can occur in structural, construction, and mechanical applications. Number six is hydrogen embrittlement. Hydrogen embrittlement can cause failure in a short period of time. The bolt's metal can become brittle after being exposed to atomic hydrogen, which is generated by the reaction of water. Overstressing a bolt can result in a change in the material called hydrogen embrittlement. If your fastener is experiencing hydrogen damage, it is necessary that the bolt is replaced right away. Tips to prevent the failure of bolts. Number one, analyze the project the bolt will be used in. Understanding the application will help you determine the force the bolt will withstand. Number two, access the environment the bolt will be used in. If the bolt will be used in an environment that experiences moisture, you should invest in corrosion resistant nuts and bolts that will be able to withstand harsh environments. Number three, invest in high quality nuts and bolts that are the proper grade for the application. Number four, make sure the bolts are not overstressed and the design is understood. Number five, apply the correct torque value to tighten the bolt during installation. Number six, during installation, avoid misalignment, rough surfaces, and high-speed installation. Number seven, 
Make sure the hole the bolt is fastened into is free from dirt and corrosion. A clear hole will ensure the torque reading is accurate. If you have any other questions regarding bolt failure, please feel free to give us a call. 888-794-1590.